Hi guys, I thought I'd share with you the topic of generating printed media using HTML screen media as the source. This is something that's come up in my career a few times. I think I narrowly got away with it with my own invoicing system, but that was quite simple. So have a look here. So I'm just generating an HTML template. You can have a look at the source. And the idea is that uh, if I change this extension, you can see the um, you can see the PDF version. Uh, it looks really ugly right now, and the the idea is that I make it pretty. I make it pretty um, thanks to some designers sharing their design using this program called Figma. Not a huge fan. And um, the reason why they share it with a, a program like Envision or, F or Figma is that that you can see their dimensions. You know the they're hard-coded pixel things. Uh, I wish there was a more of a uh, HTML-friendly design mechanism where you know they might use, I don't know, header, footer, article, section tags. You know, you see how it, it's like a definition list here, and then it becomes an image. I mean, I mean, I guess they're designing for printed media here. Yeah. So the idea is, since uh, what I'm working on here is an inspection report, you you move into a property, you have to do the inventory uh, list. Right now, it's pretty much a, a, a paper-based process, and the idea, idea is that it's going to be a digitized uh, process. So as you can imagine, the design has some like inventory and some sign-off signatures at the bottom. And, and perhaps the, the idea is that, is that we have a reference number so you can check with our system anyway. This is where it gets tricky. See how the, the signatures repeat at the bottom? How do you do that? How do you do that in HTML? How do you do that in print CSS? Notice how things like, oh, we've run out of space here invent for the inventory for the pantry, and but it continues on with the header on the next page. How do you do that in your in your printed PDF? It's pretty tricky. I, in fact, I, I you know, since I've have a past of working with web technologies, I do actually happen to have met the uh, CSS uh, person. Um, responsible for Princess and I, and, I, and I tweeted at her asking how this can be done and she basically replied saying that uh, she doesn't know how to do it which means that the user agents implementing this most certainly don't know how to do it like even doing things like this top right th header stuff seems really ropey slash difficult to do with the user agents I'm I'm really struggling. I thought I'd mention that I am using Puppeteer and I'm using my friend Lakshan's uh, sort of front end to Puppeteer or or his you know his SaaS service. So yeah, how do you do top right stuff um, as, as Print CSS describes here? I'm still trying to all work it out. I don't know if you're aware of my project. Uh, the reason why I came up with Letterly is because I'm, I'm using LaTeX as the back end, and LaTeX is built for generating uh, printed media, you know, and HTML isn't. And this is where this is where the conflict is happening here. Um, I do want everything to be HTML source based and generate PDF, but when 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 print CSS is just badly implemented and you can't do basic things as I've described here, I can't help but think. Um, this design has to be radically changed to be a lot simpler. So, um, has anyone else got experience of generating hard copies of HTML pages like I'm supposed to do here? And, and guys, you're welcome to follow along. Everything's open source what I'm working on. Um, check out this GitHub, links in the description. Uh, please like the video. Please subscribe. Please feel my pain. Please help me out. <laughs> Thanks. Bye, guys.